Good morning. Welcome to Tai Chi. I'm just, let's see. I don't know what's going on. Um, good morning. I'm just making sure everything's working, set up. So let's get started. Um, Let's see. So good morning, everybody. My name is Sheree. Um, this is Tai Chi and Qigong um, this Saturday to get yourself moving, get your energy gut flowing. So let's just put our hands on our dantian, which is two inches below our belly button. And just be mindful and take a couple deep breaths and get into the present. And just breathe into your belly and breathe out through your nose. And if you feel a little stressed, you can breathe in through your belly and breathe out through your mouth and just vision all your stress and anxiety releasing. Just take some time to get into the present moment. And then bring your hands down. Your feet are shoulder width apart. And put your hands in prayer position. And you're gonna breathe in and open up your chest. And breathe out and come in. And kind of press in your arms and your shoulders forward. Breathe in, open up, breathe out, come back. Again, breathe in, open up the chest. Breathe out and come in. Breathe in and breathe out. Breathe in and breathe out. Breathe in and out. Breathe in and out. Now we're gonna do what's called spinal cord breathing, opening up and wakening up the spine. Bring your arms up and come down Elbows come together and you tuck your tailbone in and bring your chest down to your, your belly. Breathe in and breathe out. This helps to waken up the spine, warm it up. Breathe in and out. Again, breathe in and out. This helps to oil the joints so you can start your day. It's great to do in the morning. Get out. So we're gonna breathe in, we're gonna breathe into the right and open up the chest. We're gonna get more of a twist. Come back to the center and breathe out. We're gonna breathe into the left. Come back to the center and breathe out. And breathe into the right. Come back to the center. Breathe into the left. And to the center. Right. Center. Breathe into the left. And to the center. This is great to do if you work at a computer all day. Take a break and do these spinal cord breathings to open up the chest and help open up the shoulders so they go back. Breathe in to the right. Come back. Breathe in. And come back and come down. Now you're gonna twist your waist and just twist your waist 
slowly your waist is doing all the movement and let your arms just kind of sway back and forth. And we're gonna do knocking the draw of legs. So the arm in the front is gonna be tapping the front body parts, your dantian, and the back arm is gonna hit the back, the door of life. This is great to wake you up in the morning. And then we're gonna lean over and just stretch our legs and get our legs warmed up. Then we're gonna go to one, the front arm is gonna go to the chest, open up those lung meridians. The back arm just stays to the lower back. We're gonna go over the shoulder. Back to the chest. And then back to the Dantian. If you want to put your feet parallel and then just lean, look at the opposite ankle, this will give you more of a stretch. And then slow it down and check in to see how your body's feeling. That tingling, that's your chi. We're going to breathe in and breathe out. Again, breathe in, bringing that energy up and bringing it down into our Dantian. One more time, breathe in and out. We're gonna bring your hands above your knee and you're gonna twist, bring your left shoulder to your, twist just to the kind of towards the right knee and you're gonna look back. You're going to twist your spine a little bit more. You come to the center and then go to the left, the right shoulder is kind of pulling towards the right knee, the left knee, and look back. You can come back and go to the right. Center the other way. Breathe in, go one more time, each way. And then come back to the center and then bring your arms down and just loosen up your arms and your back. I get that stretch in your hamstring. And we're just gonna swing our arms slightly. Let your arms do the swinging. And when you're comfortable, bring the arms up towards the shoulder. We're just getting a little bit more of a stretch it's called the pendulum. Again, slow it down. Slowly come up, breathe in, stretch up. And then come down. And then we're gonna put our hands back on our knees and we're just gonna sway our body back and forth like it's flowing water. 
get another stretch in the spine, just opening up and moving like water. And then you can also bring your hands and slowly like you're in the water and floating, floating like water. And then put your hands back on the knees. And then we're gonna put one hand on your, above your knee, the right hand is above. And we're gonna bring the left hand up. We're gonna come down. The left hand's gonna come down and then go to the left knee and then the right knee. Right hand is gonna come up. We're just gonna alternate. It's giving you more of a stretch. Breathe in. Your arm coming up, breathe out, and coming down. One more time to each side. Back to the center. And then bring your arms down. And we're gonna we're gonna rub our hamstrings. Circle back of our knees. And then rub the back of our shins. And we're going to tap the back of our legs, kidneys, and then the legs. Rub your kidneys and bring your arms down and slowly come up and stretch and come down, bring in that energy, bring it up and stretch and then come down, breathe out, breathe in up and down, breathe in and down. And up. And then you're going to turn your body to the right. You're going to bring your arm, your body down to the right leg and just hold it there so you get a stretch in the hamstrings. And then we're going to come up. We're going to go back down and then come down center to the left. Come up to the left. And come down. And we're going to just stay at the left side and stretch a little bit. Come back to the center. Come to the right. Come up to the right. Breathe in. Breathe out. Come down right. Center. Left. And then up. Breathe in. Left. Center. Right and up. And then come down. Center, left, and up. And then come to the center and come down. Your, your feet are a little bit farther than shoulder width apart. And we're just gonna move our hands in a circle. So we're gonna breathe in, coming up, breathe out, coming down. Breathing in. Breathe in, down. Just getting, gathering that energy, feeling that energy around you. So we're gonna go the other way. 
Breathe in and out. So we're gonna go the other way, but we're gonna start moving our legs with our body. So we're gonna twist to the left, come over, twist to the right, and then come over. So it's kind of using the legs, the whole body. And then we're gonna go the other way. Breathe in and out. So you can close your eyes and just try to envision and feel the energy that surrounds you around your arms the energy that is going through your fingertips. And come back to the center, breathe in and breathe out. Breathe in, you're gonna breathe in and then you're gonna bring your hands in, inwards and come down, breathe in and come down. So it's kind of like a breathe in, you're bringing your hands down and kind of floating like water, giving that energy down into your dantian. And come down. Now we're gonna bring our arms up and just sway. So you're bringing the energy up and around. Gathering that energy and bringing it around. And then come down, bring your hands to your hips and we're gonna rotate our hips. Go the other way. Now we're gonna use our hands. So our, our hands are gonna to be to the left, our hips are to the right. We're gonna circle around and just draw circles, sorry, with This can get kind of confusing, but it's good for the brain. bringing energy out and then in. Then we're gonna go the other way. So hands are to the right, hip is to the left, and you're going to just circle around. This is too much, you can go back to the hip rotations.
then we're gonna slow it down, come to the center, breathe in, and breathe out. One more time, breathe in, and breathe out. Breathe in, and breathe out. Bring your feet shoulder width apart. We're gonna do the pumps. So you bring your arms up, and you come down. Up, breathe in, and breathe out. This is great for the kidneys and the back and the adrenal glands, it wakes them up. And if you feel like you need to release any tension, breathe out through your mouth. And then slow it down. We're going to start tapping, wake up our meridians, wake up the body. Bring our left arm up and we're going to tap down the left arm to the right. Chest down the arm, inside. One more time. This helps to wake up meridians in your body. Let's go to the chest. Let's go to the right side. Come into the chest. up those liver meridians. Now the stomach and the liver. Go down the side of the legs. Over the foot. The inside of the legs. Back to the side of the legs. Down the side of the legs. Back to the foot. Inside of the legs. In the liver, one more time down. Inside the dantian. We're going to go to the kidneys, down the back of the legs, top of the front, and to the top, front of the legs. The kidneys, down. Back of the legs, top of the foot. To the Dantian, elixir field. This is great to do in the morning. Activate energy. And then bring your arms down. See how your body's feeling. Take a couple deep breaths. So you're gonna bring your hands to your belly like you're holding a ball and we're gonna breathe in. Palms up and then we're gonna breathe out and come down. Again, breathe in. And out and come down. Breathe in. And out. Again, breathe in. Palms up and come down. And breathe in. You can actually hold your breath, palms up, hold your breath, and then come down. Again, breathe in, palms up, hold your breath, and come down. Breathe in, This exercise is great to 
activate the lungs. And then come down. And you're gonna come out, bring your knuckles together and you're just gonna draw them around. Breathe in and out, just drawing a circle with both hands. Breathe in and out. Breathe in. It's called the fountain. It's good for the kidneys. I kind of exaggerate to really activate the kidneys and the adrenal glands. Breathe in. So then we're going to go one at a time, right, round, breathe in and out, left, breathe in and out. So you, also you're shifting your legs and your body in like a circle eight. So you're breathing in, up, breathing out, down. You just want to feel that energy. You can feel the energy. You're present. Feel the energy that surrounds your arms when you're moving your legs, moving your arms, moving your legs, feeling that energy surrounding you and inside you and around you. So now we're going to go to cloud hands, which is the hands come parallel to your heart. The left is parallel to the heart, the right is down. Then we reverse the when we're going to the right, the right is up and the left is down. Just giving energy to the heart. It's to focus on the present moment and what is around you, being mindful of the movement. You can go as slow or fast as you want. The slower you go, the more energy you accumulate. The faster you go, you're releasing energy. Come back to the center. The left arm is up, the right arm is gonna come back and over, and bring energy to the left hand. Then the right replaces the left and the left comes over. It's called Repulse the Monkey and it's great for the liver. You can feel that energy giving it to your meridians in your inside of your arms. Breathing in and breathing out.
And then you're just gonna grab that energy. See if you can feel that energy ball. Breathe in and breathe out. Breathe in and out. The energy should be like a magnet, magnetizing and just kind of automatically bring your hands back and forth. If you can't feel it, that's okay. Sometimes you can, if you pulse a little bit more, you can actually feel the energy. So now we're gonna take that energy and we're gonna bring our hands out like we're putting our hands in a pond and breathe in, breathe out. So we can also go one at a time again, but in a different direction. Connecting your energy to the earth energy. And come back to the center, bring your right foot forward, your left foot back. And we're just gonna circle and bring that energy around. The movement is relaxed. You should be relaxed, just breathing, being present and being mindful of the movement. This is standing meditations. Standing, moving. If you have a hard time meditating, these are great exercises to get you your practice. Practice being mindful of each movement you're doing. And let's we come back and we put the left foot forward and we do the same thing on the left side. Breathing in and out. And then come back to the center. Again, breathe in. Feel that ball. We're gonna take that energy, we're gonna breathe in that energy up the spine and over the solar plexus. And breathe in and breathe out coming forward. Envision breathing in up the spine and breathing out, forward. Breathing in energy up the spine. This is recycling your energy, your chi. So we're gonna bring in, forward, over the chest. Breathing in, up. Just 
watching this one. We're going to go over the head, breathe in, up, and over the head, out, over the head, breathe in, and out. Recycling your energy. Then bring your hands down again, you hold that ball. So we're gonna breathe in. Make our, our thumbs touch and our four fingers touch. Breathe out, come down and come up. Breathe in. So we're gonna come to the heart center, breathe out. Come down, breathe in, up, breathe out, come down. Heart center, you're giving energy to somebody and then giving energy to yourself. Breathe in, gather energy up, come back to the center, breathe out. Breathe in, energy to yourself. Again, breathe in, breathe out. Hold that energy, give energy to somebody that you think needs it. Send it out through that triangle. Breathe in and breathe out and give energy to yourself. Again, breathe in. Breathe out. This is a great receiving, giving and receiving energy. Gather energy, bring it down to your heart. Give energy to somebody who needs it or the world. Breathe out and then bring energy to yourself. And breathe in. And then bring that energy and just hold that triangle to your heart. I'm just envisioning giving energy to the world, positive energy, positive light. And then come down and then just hold, give yourself energy. Send yourself some positive love, positive energy, gratitude. And then come up and come down. Breathe in and breathe out. And breathe in and breathe out. One more time, breathe in and breathe out. Get and hold that ball. Breathe in and out. I'm going to go right into the Tai Chi. Yang eight form. We'll just do it a couple times. So your feet are shoulder width apart, knees bent, tailbone tucked. We're going to take a step out, shoulders relaxed. We're going to breathe in and breathe out. Breathe in and breathe out. One more time. Breathe in and breathe out. Keep your left hand up. Your right hand is going to come up and over. Gather energy to the left. The left, right is going to replace the left. Left comes up and over. Give that energy to the right. Both hands come to the right. You take a step to the left. You brush your knee with the left hand and push with the right. You come together. Both hands come to the left. You take a step with the right foot. You brush the knee with the right hand and you push with the left. Feet come together, you hold the ball with your right hand on top. You take a step with the left foot and you swipe up. So the right hand comes down to your right hip, the left comes up. 
feet come together and we hold a ball with the left hand on top. We take a step to the right, we swipe up. So the left hand is right by the left hip and the right hand is up. Right hand comes down, we do cloud hands and we're gonna take a step. Right hand comes down, left hand comes up and we're gonna take a step to the left, doing cloud hands a couple times. And then we go back to the right. So what we call rooster stands in one leg. The right foot is, is up. If you can't lift your foot up, just toe, tap your toe to the floor. Right hand is, you're protecting your hand. The left is protecting the elbow. Come down. Rooster stands on one leg to the left. Back, we cross and we kick to the right. So the hands are out and we're kicking to the right. Come back, we cross, and we kick to the left. Hold the ball with the left hand on, right hand on top. We take a step to the left, we swipe up. Both hands come over to the right. The right hand pushes that left wrist directly above the left knee. We come down and we push. We come together and we hold a ball with a right hand on top. We take a step and we swipe up. Both hands come over to the left. Left hand pushes that right wrist above the right knee. We come down and we push. We cross and we finish. Let's do that one more time. Again, feet are Feet are slightly bent, tailbone is tucked, shoulders relaxed, head is, vision is string, pulling your head up, chin is tucked in a little bit, tongue the top is on the top of your roof of your mouth. We're gonna take a step, we're gonna breathe in, and breathe out. Breathe in, and breathe out. Breathe in, and breathe out. Let's do it one more time. Breathe in and breathe out. Keep that left hand up. The right hand is going to come up and over. Bring that energy to the left hand. The right hand is going to come to the front and the left hand is going to come back. Gather that energy. Both hands are going to come to the right. We're going to take a step with the left foot. Brush the knee with the right left hand. Push with the right. We come together. We hold. Both hands come to the left. We take a step with the right. We brush the knee with the right and we push with the left. Feet come together. We hold a ball with the right hand on top. We take a step with the left. We swipe up. So the right hand is by the hip, left is up. Feet come together. We hold a ball with the left hand on top. We take a step with the right. And we swipe up. Right hand comes down, left hand comes up, and we take a couple steps. This is cloud hands to the left, and then we go back to the right. And then we go right into rooster stands on one leg. Rooster stands on one leg. We cross and we kick. We cross and we kick. Hold the ball with the right hand on top. We take a step, we swipe up. Both hands come over to the right. The right hand pushes that left wrist above the left knee. Breathe in, and breathe out. If you come together, we hold the ball with the left hand on top. We take a step with the right, we swipe up. Both hands come to the left. Left hand pushes that right wrist Above the knee, breathe in, push, and come down. Let's do that one more time. Take a step, breathe in, and out. Breathe in, and out. Breathe in, and out. Left hand. Is forward, right comes back. 
right gives energy to the left, rights forward, left comes back. Both hands come to the right. We take a step with the left, brush the knee and push. We come together, both hands come to the left. We take a step with the right, brush the knee and push. We come together, we hold a ball with the right hand on top. We take a step, we swipe up. If we come together, we hold a ball with the left hand on top. We take a step and we swipe up. Right hand comes down, left hand comes up, and we do cloud hands. One, two, back to the right. One, two, we break. Go right into rooster stands on one leg. Rooster stands on one leg. We cross and we kick. Sorry. We cross and we kick. We hold the ball with the right hand on top. We take a step. We swipe up. Both hands come over to the right. Right hand pushes that left wrist. Breathe in and out. We come together. We hold the ball with the left hand on top. Swipe up. Both hands come over to the left. We push. We cross and we finish. Let's breathe in and breathe out. Again, breathe in and breathe out. One more time, breathe in and breathe out. So bring your right hand underneath your dantian. The left hand is going to come up and we're going to do centering. Centering what we've done today. Left replaces the right, right, breathe in and come down. Breathe in. We're just centering everything we've done today in this class. Breathe in. And bring your hands on your dantian. And just take a couple deep breaths. This is a standing meditation, bamboo in the wind, to help you feel your energy. If you sway, that's okay. It's just your chi circulating in your body. Hope everybody has a fabulous weekend. And have a great week. See you next week. Thank you. Have a great day.